NCTV45 presents The Thought for the Day. Monday through Friday, we give you a message of spirituality and inspiration. Your host. Good morning. Our thought for today is about churches, pastors, and elections. A church legally cannot corporately endorse or oppose a candidate for political office. But there are other things clearly permissible that do not cross this line. Churches can certainly educate about political and moral and biblical issues. These kinds of issues, whether abortion, marriage, feeding the poor, or any other political issue in your community are never off limits. The IRS can never tell a pastor what to preach or what to teach. A pastor can also educate the people in the pews about the different candidates' positions on moral issues, whether they are running as an incumbent or as a challenger. Pastors have individual rights, too. Not only can pastors talk about an issue where a candidate stands, they can also talk about the importance of being a voice to the community. Pastors and churches can distribute objective voter guides, which are produced by many organizations, as long as it is an objective uh, voter guide, laying out the views of the candidates, it is permissible under IRS rules. Voter guides can be distributed to people in the pews and in the community as educational material in order that readers can understand the views of the candidates. In short, you can talk about biblical issues. Educate people about what the candidates' views are in these issues and then encourage them to vote. And that's our thought for today. With love.